What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Gonzo and today I'm doing another review um, of PSA card returns. And here are six Japanese cards, um, four vintage, two modern. I'm really excited for them. I don't know the grades. I didn't get any sneak peeks at all for this one like I did with the first one. Now that I know what I'm doing. Um, let's just jump right into it. If you're new to the channel and you like what you see, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Comment down below what your favorite card from today is. If you think the grades were deserved or undeserved. And don't forget, at 400 subs, I will be doing a giveaway for the Jumbo 25th Anniversary Partner Collection. From the Pikachu Binder, Gen 1 all the way to Gen 9. But for now, let's get into this. Let's go. So if you guys saw the last video, you saw how much trouble I had. Um, but it looks like the packaging is a little different. I did pre-slice it. I didn't try to fight it at all. It is extremely different packaging. But let's get into it. It's a, just another six, so it's nothing too crazy. Um, so let's check out the back of this one. Does there's a little whiting on here? All, all I'm gonna be honest. All, all these cards are not gonna. I know for sure none of them are gonna be tens because, uh, just like this one, there's gonna be whiting on a lot of these cards, like up here at the top, corners, corner. The, these corners are really bad. We have the uh, Typhlosion Hollow Japanese Neo. The front side doesn't look too bad. Oh, there's a scuff down there. I didn't see that when I first sent it. Small one here. So the surface is not going to be good. But what do you... I think it's going to be... With all those damage to the corners, the scuffs up here. Another scuff down here on the corner. I think it's going to be maybe... Maybe a 6. A 5. So I wasn't too far off. Um, all these grades... If you guys are fans of the channels, you guys know I don't care about 10s or anything. These are all personal collection. I don't plan on selling any of them. So, I, like I said, I'm really excited for them. It's another vintage uh, Japanese card. Doesn't look like the back of this one's that bad. That whiting is from the, the case. It looks pretty solid on the back. Turn it over. Got the fur alligator. Doesn't look too bad on the front. Um, but like I said, I'm not expecting a 10s from this. Because when I first sent this one in, um, I, was, I, I think I saw some kind of whiting. But let's check it out. For Alligator Hollow from Japanese Neo. An 8. So there's something that I'm not seeing. Is it maybe that scuff up there? It might be the corners or something. But overall, I'm not mad at that score. It's, it is an 8. It sucks that they're not all the same for for the starters. Got the, got a modern one. Let's see. Let's see. Back doesn't look too bad. Turn it over. The Tea Ceremony Pikachu from 2019. I think this was the only one that I expected to be a 10 and the other like if I was going to get a 10 it was going to be these two modern ones I don't see anything bad so it's either going to be a 9 or a 10 it's a 9 I don't know why I don't see anything maybe they saw something on the surface or on the back on the corners doesn't look too bad though to me so we got a 9 so far 5, 8, 9 Let's do that. Another vintage. Got some whiting up here on the top. I think that's a scuff up there. I can't tell. I don't know if you guys can see from there right next to my thumbnail. That's all I see on that side. Ooh, the Japanese Lugia Neo. Some scuffs down here. Overall looks pretty good to me. Let's see what we got. A four. Why is it a four? No way. 
There has to be something more to it. Let's see. Can I... Because the camera zoomed in a little bit. I don't... It, is it because of that that jumped it that made it go down so low that scuff right there can you guys see it right here that right on that light but a four no like there's there's a lot of whiting on the back but i don't think it deserved a four maybe like a six or a seven that's crazy so we got a four a five an eight and a nine the last vintage. Let's look at it. Back looks pretty good. I don't see any whiting anywhere. Looks really good to me. Turn over. The Meganium. We did get all three starters. Let's check that out. It looks that looks really good. Got, oh, I didn't realize there's a swirl there. Fancy. Let's see, let's see. Another eight. I don't know why I got an eight. I'm not mad at this. Like the the frogator and the meganium. I'm not mad at. I'm obviously not mad at the tea ceremony. The typhlosion. The the lugia though. Kind of, kind of questionable. Okay, let's check out. The last modern one, I know what it is now just because uh, process of elimination. This is the Shibuya uh, Pikachu promo. Doesn't look too bad. That was um The back looks really good. The back looks actually really solid. Nothing too crazy. Check out that front. Got the Mewtwo, the Pokemon Center Shibuya. Looks really good. Let's see what we got though. A four. Whoa. Okay. How how did this get the same grade as the Lugia? I don't see anything wrong with it. At all. There's no way that this is a four. Was there a bend in the card that I didn't see? That's crazy that this is a four. That's absolutely insane to me that this is a four. But it is what it is. If I decide to pay money again to have it regraded and it comes back as another four, I'm gonna have I'm gonna have some questions. Cause this this is just ridiculous. Two fours, two fours, a five. Two eights and one nine. I'm gonna be honest, I wasn't expecting this one to come back as a five and the Lugia to come back as a four, and definitely not that Shibuya Pikachu as a four. Overall, like I said, I'm a personal collector, but I still want decent grades. That's this is that's rough. It is what it is. I can't complain a whole lot. I am the one who sent them in. Um, but again, let me know down in the comment section down below what you believe the grades should have been, what your favorite card is that uh, came back, and don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button, guys. Until next time, I'll talk to you later, and my name is Gonzo. Peace.